just what's it like being old back? Times. It, it really does feel like <laughs> old times, and this event is starting to feel like old times. Like, what, what do you make of how it's grown? Yeah, it's awesome. You know, it's it's our fourth year now in six in, in six. We had two years off because of COVID, so that kind of threw a wrench in things. But it's amazing to be to be here. First time here at Eagles Nest, and I uh, got an amazing group of, of players coming to, to support, and and of course all the volunteers here. It's just a, it's a huge event uh, to put on, and and the day is just is, is awesome. So we enjoy it. Yeah, you mentioned the guest list. Some pretty high profile names. What does that support mean to you? Yeah, it's awesome. You know, I got a bunch of my teammates here, obviously, and, and there's some pretty good players. Uh, uh, not, you know, pretty average golfers, but good, good hockey players. Um, and then a bunch of guys from other teams. Uh, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be a, a really fun event. And the, the charities. Can you maybe take a moment mm -hmm. to express, you know, what they mean to you? Yeah, they're well. The, the charities are Sick Kids is, is the main benefactor, and then UJ Toronto and UJ Edmonton and uh, Sick Kids is is near and dear to my heart. I grew up in Toronto, and uh, actually my my firstborn son Theo went to Sick Kids. He wears hearing aids, so um, yeah, definitely have a, a, a special place for for Sick Kids and been supporting them for for a long time. And then UJ grew up in the Jewish community, so it's important to, to give back to to you know your community, and, and we support uh, Jewish children's charities through through that effort in Toronto and both in Edmonton. So both places where I played. How's the golf game for you, Zach? Has it improved a little bit since last year? Uh, I was telling Con I'm playing with Connor Leon, uh, Freddie Wax, is, who is awesome, a uh, huge supporter, uh, and Elliot Friedman, that's kind of our group, and uh, we're, sh we're hoping to shoot par. <laughs> we're going to hit a basketball. <laughs> Eagles Nest is pretty hard. I haven't uh, picked up a club since uh, the Edmonton Oilers golf tournament, so you know we may need you, you to take a, a ringer shot for us, Tone. There's a lot of big rough and a lot of trees around here. How many balls did you come equipped yeah, with? A lot of water, too. <laughs> Uh, not enough, <laughs> yeah, so you're going to have to ask them for more. Yeah, for sure, yeah. Zach. Uh, just a quick comment on, on the season. Now that you've had some time to kind of decompress and take some time to evaluate how it went, how would you kind of categorize it for you as a group? Uh, so close. I, you know, just right there, obviously the team we lost to two years in a row now has, has won it. So, um, you yeah, know, you feel like you're right there, and, and it's still, it still kind of stings because um, – like I said, this year we're probably closer than ever. So uh, it's motivation to, to for next year that that we're right there. And we just have to keep keep pushing the envelope and and keep getting better. And uh, yeah, it's it's been a, a fun off season. It's, it's fun you know to have a day like this, which takes your mind off of, of everything and just enjoy. You know, we're in we're in the mid mid mid. It's like a mid break in summer, so it's yeah, good. For sure. Yeah. What sort of impact do you think a guy like Connor Brown's gonna make? Yeah, you know Connor Brown too. <laughs> Well, I, I, I'm excited uh, for, for Brownie. Obviously, we played together in Toronto, and and uh, we played well together, and, and he's just such a, an elite worker, right? Kind of, We're kind of similar in that regard. We were always kind of compared to each other when we were in Toronto as these two worker bees, and um, great to have him in Edmonton and, and get him back there, and it's uh, it's great. We got a, a bunch of former Leafs, obviously, so uh, great to add him into the mix. What was the murder wedding like? That was fun. It was fun. I'm sure you saw some videos on socials, and um, yeah, Mitch is a, is a fun guy, so he likes to dance and 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 move. And uh, yeah, it was uh, you know him and Steph uh, put on a great wedding, and it was you know really uh, really fun to be a part of. Out of ten, what would you give the gritty that he came out with? <laughs> he did the fake uh, leg injury too, and everything. Huh? I don't know. It was pretty good. I, I, I mean, ten because I couldn't do it. I would I'd be a two. So he, he can move pretty well.